Hey City Connects team, this is Dean Coles, Director of City Connects. I'm here with my brother Michael Walker, Pastor of Church in the City. And we just love to have you guys come and serve in Denver. Great place to serve any time of the year and they have a great time, wouldn't they? Oh, they're going to have a marvelous time. Denver uh, has a lot going on and being in the center of all that gives you such an opportunity to take part in so many different things. Besides it being the home of Peyton Manning and the Denver Broncos. Right. Uh, there's many, many things that are going on in the city, and, and we're just excited to have you join us. Hey, man, come join us. You won't regret it. Take right. care. God bless you. to have you come and visit and serve and, and just be blessed as well as being a blessing for uh, coming into Denver. And we have a full-blown full, uh, full blown kitchen. Be able to provide anything. We do a lot of cooking for uh, right outside the doors here is about 100 kids. We also do a lot of cooking for homeless and for our church family as well. So you guys are going to have a wonderful time fed spiritually and, and uh, in your bodies as well. We're so like one block away from the largest high school in Denver, East High. And we've had a relationship with them for over 25 years. And we've offered them to come. They come during lunch hour. We feed them. We share what does it mean to be a biblical man or... Uh, a woman who seeks after God, we give them an opportunity during their lunch hour to ask questions and just be spoken into. It's an amazing relationship we've built over the years with uh, Denver East High School. Uh, uh, for here again, it's been an amazing journey for us. Uh, what started for me in the '60s living as a hippie, traveling all over Europe, South America, the Middle East, looking for the answer to life, and finally found it in 1971 in California during those crazy Jesus freak days. Wound up in Denver back here in 1981 and uh, started uh, ministering to the least of these, started ministering to the poor, the oppressed, the needy, just bringing the church to the people that weren't going to church. We started in an old Safeway store right on uh, Koufax, across the street from where we're at now. And uh, uh, we've been there for 20, almost 20 years, and we've developed relationships with all the homeless on the streets, and as well as the high school next door, which is East High School, 2,200 kids, very multiracial, multicultural. And then God opened a door for us, amazingly, to be able to go back to my own Jewish roots, my grandfather was a rabbi, to be able to restore one of the oldest synagogues in Denver and bring it back to its original grandeur, which is where we sit right now. Yeah, what an amazing blessing it is. On a Saturday, we do a Shabbat service. And on Sunday, we do two regular Sunday-type services, and it's all one congregation. It's just two different expressions, how people want to express their worship, but it's all about Yeshua, all about Jesus. We do it in a multicultural, multiracial environment. We've got homeless to doctors, lawyers. It's just really a, a taste of heaven every uh, Sunday and Saturday morning as well. And we are so thankful and blessed for that privilege and opportunity God has given us to speak into the least of these and, and to really see lives change uh, by the power of the Holy Spirit of Jesus Christ. When we first got here, all the windows were boarded up and we wanted to find out what was here before and we went to the Colorado History Museum and found out the designs of all the stained glass windows and we wanted to duplicate them to exactly the way they were. Even the scriptures, we put the same scriptures that were here before. Psalm 1-3, and he shall be like a tree planted by the streams of water. Uh, things like that, that we really wanted to restore this place to its original grandeur. A place where people can come and worship the one true God. David's tent. This is a place we have a, a coffee uh, bar here. We have a stage. This is where you'll be eating, hanging out, fellowshipping, uh, and do some worship. Uh, we have all these video screens that they're going to be showing videos and so on. We host youth here all the time, so uh, you, you'll enjoy this. The base, our ministry center, where you'll be staying. This used to be in 1938 the uh, largest Hebrew school 
in uh, in Denver. They had over the uh, ministry center of Church in the City, where you'll be staying. And on each side of me, this used to be a Hebrew uh, school with 600 students. So there's lots of room, lots of classrooms that you guys will be sleeping in. Restrooms up here, showers next door in the church. So uh, great place for everybody to stay. Got more rooms down here. Wow. Yeah. Hang on. And then. Okay, he got it. He got it. Wow, look at this. Oh, my goodness. Yes, it is.